on, it's Sarah Dawn here. I'm gonna show you some cool things I got for Christmas. I know what you're saying. It's already January, Sarah. Why didn't you have this video up in December? Well, I was on vacation, first of all, so I was out in River John with my family. Uh, we didn't come back home until like the 28th, I think. Anyways, I've been working right since I got home from Christmas. Also, I had to figure out a way to fix my own camera so that it would record. Um, I'll have another whole story up about that in the coming weeks. I broke my camera, crazy story. I figured out a way to kind of fix it. It's probably not going to work for a very long time, but right now this is why the setup's so weird and I'm not in my normal spot. It's because I have my camera hooked up to my TV so that I can see myself in the TV because my LCD screen's not working right now. I'm so excited to show you guys some of the stuff I got for Christmas. All right, let's start. I don't know if you guys know what Scentsy is. Um, it's basically like uh, candles, but it's also a decoration. So it's like you get these warmers, uh, and it's just like these decorations with light bulbs in them, and then you can buy all these different scented wax blocks that you put in the top, and when they melt, it makes your room smell fabulous. And my sister's a Scentsy consultant, so obviously I got some Scentsy for Christmas. So I'm gonna show it to you. My grandmother got me this warmer, and I know it looks really plain, but she also got me, uh, I think they call them cages in the Scentsy world, which you put over the plain warmer. And so you can buy all the different cages to put over this one warmer, so it's really convenient because you can have one warmer with a bunch of different looks. She got me this little dragonfly cage to put over it. I love it. Uh, this is going in my living room. I'm taking out my Christmas warmer and I'm going to put this one in. I also have one in the background there uh, with a paw print on it. I love Scentsy. I have one in almost every room except the kitchen. I should get one for the kitchen. But anyways, this is one of my presents from my nanny. My aunt got me a hand blender which I really need it because I like to make smoothies and stuff and I had like an old blender that wasn't working too well. So it's just really nice. I love this a lot. It just comes apart like this to clean, so super convenient. Way better than the blender. I was so done with the blender. No more blenders unless I get like a magic bullet or some shit like that because I'm not dealing with blenders anymore. I'll tell you that story some other day. I just, no. I'm not doing it anymore. So this is like a lifesaver to me. I'm really excited to start using it. I haven't tried it yet, but maybe I'll let you know some other time how it works. My grandmother got me this necklace, and this necklace, and this necklace, which I'm pretty sure I picked out in the store and I forgot about it, and then she gave it to me for Christmas. And thank you, I love it. It's very pretty, it's very me. Last year at Christmas, Dustin got me the new Viz Media dubbed version of Sailor Moon season one. Uh, which I love because it's way better storyline than what Bic did to Sailor Moon. I'm not even gonna get into that. So this year he got me Sailor Moon R Part 1 dubbed. Um, Part 2 actually came out right after Christmas, which now I want that too. Um, but I haven't gotten through this yet. I actually started watching it yesterday and I have, there's like a DVD player attached to my TV. So I stuck it in there and it friggin got stuck and I had such a panic attack. Dustin got it out, he's my prince, it's all, it's all good. Anyways, mm, listen to it, oh this, oh my, just so much Sailor Moon. If you don't know me, I'm addicted to Sailor Moon. There's a cat in the background. Speaking of cats, I also got this cat shirt from my aunt. It says, perfect holiday. Also speaking of that, I got a shitload of cat stuff for Christmas which I'm gonna show you now. So the first thing I got was a cat onesie from my mom. It has a cat on it, as you can see. It covers the whole onesie. Cat earrings, also from my mother. They're like those cool ones where the head and the back is attached to them, like between your ear. If you get what I mean, you get what I'm saying. So like the face is on one side, and then it, but it has the tail and stuff. Yeah, fabulous. A cat statue. Another cat statue. They match. Got these from my grandma. Cat pajamas. Ooh. These are from my mother. A cat candle from my grandma. Cat stickers for my wall. These are from my niece. A giant cat makeup bag from my mom. This is just what I needed. 
cat oven mitts from my aunt. She knows me very well. A kitty calendar also from my aunt. Now that it's January, I could probably actually open this and put it on my wall. But I was waiting to show you all in this video. Oh my goodness, what's this one? An actual cat! Oh wait, I've had you for a while. Okay, mm, sure. Mm, mm, you can go. Maybe this one? Huh? Nah, I've had this one for a while too. I didn't get any cats for Christmas. Even though I wanted one. My boyfriend says two's enough. That's most of the cat stuff I got. Um, probably got a few more little things, but those were like the noteworthy cat things I got. Oh yeah, also got a bottle of catnip. Cause I don't do drugs, but I like to snort some catnip on my days off. Just joking, I got that for my cats for Christmas. Moving on, so now that the segment about cats is over, let's move on to my not cat items. My mother got me this elf palette. It has 100 colors in it. I'm wearing them today. They're lovely, fabulous, love it, everything about it, sparkly, mattes, you know. I love elf, they're cruelty free, this is awesome. Anyways, yeah, elf's one of my favorite companies, my mom knew that. She saw this 100 color palette and was like, that's... That's what Sarah needs, because that is what I need. I need lots of makeup. My mother-in-law got me a mini brush set with four brushes, which I was very excited about. I asked my boyfriend for brushes for Christmas, so I assumed he had told his mother that I needed brushes, but apparently she can just read my mind. I especially needed this brush because I got new unique foundation, which calls for like a big blusher brush rather than a foundation brush. So that came in very handy. And I also needed a new blender brush for my eyeshadow because mine was starting to just get gross and I hate it and it wasn't blending right. So I love this one. I used it today. Those were two brushes I really needed. The other two is a concealer brush which I also actually found out I really need it because it works way better than using your finger. Who would have thought? Not me. Uh, and then I also got an eyebrow brush. I did have an eyebrow brush. I kind of like this one better, uh, especially for the powdered portion. I find it spreads it a lot better. Uh, and these are called Still Spa Brushes. I don't know, they're really nice. I like them. My grandmother got me the new uh, Unique Foundation Mineral Touch. Um, I've already used it. This is the one that you see on the computer a lot that looks like magic. They put it on like a blush brush and just spread it all over their face and it covers like all rosacea and everything. It's an amazing foundation. I wouldn't call it magical like what you see in those videos. It does cover up all my red spots and it's super easy to blend into your skin. It covers up all my red marks and stuff. The only thing I, it hasn't really covered is like if I have like a scab or a, or a bad pimple. But this is still the best foundation I've ever used in my life. My mother also got me more makeup. Did I mention that my nanny got me the, the unique makeup? I think I did. Okay. Well, my mother got me more makeup. She got me the e.l.f. palette, but she also got me the e.l.f. translucent powder. If you've been following my channel, you know this is my absolute favorite face powder ever. It's the best one I've ever used. It's amazing. It's cruelty free. Um, I use it every day, and so thank God she got me another one because I'm almost out of the one I bought a few months ago. It would probably last longer if I didn't use it every day, but yeah, this is my absolute favorite face powder. She also got me a new Wet n Wild mascara, which is also cruelty free. Haven't had the chance to try it yet. I should try it soon. Maybe I'll review it in another video for you. I'm sure it works fabulous. Wet n Wild's an amazing company. My aunt also got me this awesome Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse candy jar. I love it so much. Uh, it's beautiful and it was filled with candy when she gave it to us, but Dustin opened this present and then Dustin ate most of the candy. So there's still some candy in there. He has eaten a lot of it. I've eaten a lot of it too. Let's not let's not kid myself. I've eaten so much candy out of this candy jar. But oh my god, this is just so cute. I love this so much. It's going in my living room. I love Mickey and Minnie. It's adorable. My grandmother also got me curtains for my bedroom. They're like a burgundy sparkly gold kind of curtain. Um, as you can see, my bed comforter's got like some burgundy and black and white going on. So this really matches my bedroom. My bedroom's mostly done in like black and burgundy. Uh, also, I'm a sparkly person, so I love the sparkles. So this is really pretty and I can't wait to hang it up. So not only did my boyfriend get me the Sailor Moon R DVD, he also got me a $75 gift card to Sephora with a free 45 minute makeover, which I'm super excited about. My grandmother also got me a gift card to Sephora. 
and it came with a little mirror and as you can see the card's already missing because I already went to Sephora and bought shit with that $50 gift card. I'm gonna be doing a Sephora haul video once I use Dustin's gift card and hopefully you'll stay tuned to my channel for that. There's two more things I want to show you. Technically I didn't get them for Christmas, I actually got them for graduation. Um, which I graduated in October, so I got these things around October, but they're two of my favorite things and I want to include them in this video, so I'm going to show you anyways. So the first is a custom Sailor Moon phone case that my mother got me. It has my name on it, Sarah Dawn. Um, this came from Twinkle Bee International. I will link the Facebook page in the description below. I love this phone case. It's the best thing ever. It's very me. It's very pink sparkly, Sailor Moon, uh, you know. I've actually gotten so many compliments on this phone case. Um, you can get them in any color. Uh, you can write whatever you want on them. Uh, there's not just Sailor Moon ones. You don't have to get a Sailor Moon one, but of course I did because I love Sailor Moon. So... This is awesome. And my other graduation gift that I got was from my boyfriend. And it's a jewelry box, but it's not just any type of jewelry box. It's a snap-on jewelry box. So if you don't know what snap-on is, it's basically a tool shop for mechanics. Um, it's very well known in the mechanic world. They sell like uh, large toolboxes, uh, any kind of tool you can think of. But one of their biggest things is, is toolboxes. My boyfriend actually bought a toolbox from them. Uh, and apparently he picked this up around the same time because he thought it was so cute and then he gave it to me for graduation. So it's a little miniature snap-on toolbox for jewelry and it opens like this and we have all of our drawers here and I just think this is the cutest thing ever, a little pink snap-on toolbox for my jewelry. I don't know who thought of that but it was genius. I love it. It is so adorable. There's also one thing that I can't show you in the video because I had to leave it back in River John, which is two hours away from where I live. That's where my family lives. My mother got me a hand-painted Sailor Moon poster with my name on it. Um, I couldn't bring it because my car was so stuffed and it's not framed yet. She's looking for a frame because it's a different size, a size that's hard to find a frame for. So I couldn't bring it with me for fear that it'd get damaged on the drive. I didn't want my other Christmas presents falling on it and chipping the paint or it get wet or something. I just didn't want to risk it so I left it in River John. Uh, when I do get to bring it to Dartmouth when it's all framed, I will show you guys because it's pretty friggin cool. And I love Sailor Moon a lot, my mom knows that, so she always gets me a lot of Sailor Moon stuff. So of course I got a lot of other things, these are just some of my favorites. I do have other favorites, this video is already going on forever, so I'm gonna stop there. I love it all, there's not a thing I didn't like. Um, I got a lot of gift cards, my sister gave me a gift card to Sobeys, which is great because we got to come home and buy a bunch of groceries and eat them. Which eating is my favorite thing, and I was so grateful to have a Sobeys gift card. I hope you had a good Christmas. If you would like to make a video of the things you got for Christmas and you want me to see it, you can post it on my new Facebook page, which is facebook.com slash thesdrj. I will watch it, I promise. If you post it on my Facebook, I will watch it. Go hit like on my Facebook page. You can also follow me on Twitter and Instagram at the SDRJ. I'm always on Instagram. I love Instagram. I'm always putting pictures of animals and makeup and such things like that. So go follow me on Instagram. I really hope everybody had a good Christmas or whichever holiday you celebrate. I hope everybody had a great holiday. Um, spent it with their family. And... That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like and comment down below what you got for Christmas if you can't make me a video. I love to hear from you guys so much. Alrighty, Happy New Year everybody. I hope 2016 is great and I will see you next time. It's hard to, uh, th with the direction, it's backwards in the TV, unlike when I use my camera, so it's really confusing right now. She wants to say hello. Oh, look at the button. Oh.